Hey Lisa, thanks for coming in today. I really appreciate it. You know I'm a huge sports fan and I'm highly competitive and I'm always coming up with new and exciting things for my Prime Power members. I don't know if you know this, so I'm going to let you in on a little secret. About a year ago I started this Prime Power program and we grew our membership from 2400 to where over 50,000 Prime Power members are. And I started the CEO, CEO blog and they're all just so excited, they're pumped up, but I'm getting these communications from my Prank Power members, my loyal members, and they're telling me, Tim, you gotta spice this up a little bit. You're just a little too boring. Gotcha. You need to bring out something new and exciting. And I've been working with this group called Kids in Need, and they are just amazing. And I'm helping them with children all through the whole country with product donations and corporate sponsors and various other things, but I really want to get to know them from the inside. I really want to get into their operation. Can you help me with that? I sure can. Okay, because, you know, we're a 218-year-old company, and Grandpa Joseph Dixon, God rest his soul, he, he's just, I want him to be proud of me. So can I get you on this project right away? Sounds good. I will take care of that. Lisa Mack here with Pencil Time News, where we get to the point and keep on sharpening. Today, we visit Dixon Ticonderoga, the home of the world's best pencils and art supplies. We are about to witness a very exciting event for the Dixon employees, an event that many say marks their favorite time of year. What could this event be? None other than the famous Kids in Need donation. Every year, Dixon assembles a team to make sure the best donation possible is sent to our Kids in Need partner. Let's look in and see how it all starts. All right, people, it's donation time, and I want a good one. Those kids need school supplies stacked. Let me see what you got. I, I have analyzed all our inventions and stock, and I have been able to identify numerous supplies that are currently available for donation. Did you give them crayons? You know color wands are my favorite. I also found some special items I think the kids in stores would love. Uh, maybe a giant tub of colored pencil, perhaps? And don't forget the erasers. You can't send pencils and leave out the erasers. Everybody makes mistakes. Hand them over. Let me see. Hmm. Is this a joke? Oh, honestly, people, I need more pencils. Those kids need to write. And what is this? Only 500 packs of art markers? Children need art for their soul. Look, people, I need 54% pencils, 32% art supplies, and 27% writing markers. But, Kristen, that's more than 100%. Well, we're just going to have to find a way to make it happen. I am not going to miss this. I'm coming in to help load in those trucks, and I'm bringing my cowgirl boots. Finally, the supplies have been chosen. Next comes the difficult part of getting the Dixon Ticonderoga Director of Finance to sign off. So this is the order, huh? I'm not sure if we have enough reserves to do a donation this big. But Pam, think of the kids. Have a heart. They need those supplies. Yeah, don't be a Scrooge. <laughs> All right, twist my arm, will you? I'll make it work. This is approved. Thank you. The approved order is now ready to be placed in our system. This is a very exciting part of the Kids in Need donation. Customer service is ready and willing. Let's see how it goes. I'm proud to announce I have the approved Kids in Need donation order here in my hand. Kids in need donation order. Let me see it. Awesome. Okay, who can I trust to enter this special order? Me, 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 me. Me. Okay, there you go, Christine. Yay. Oh, yeah. We did it last time. Oh, so nice. Yeah. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
am very excited to take home the watercolor, the praying watercolors. And so coming and getting the Dixon pencils, we happen to love those as teachers because they sharpen really well. Um, but it's just wonderful to uh, have these companies who supply these donations because it helps me as a teacher, again, supplement my classroom, but then there are also children who don't have those items, so it helps us in that way as well. I don't think I've ever had to spend money on glue sticks, markers, or pencils because they're always supplied here and watercolors. Again, I didn't have to order watercolors when we ran out because they were here to get for teaching. Yes, I especially love these right here. This was on the shelf. It started this year and being able to use things on different surfaces like fabric and all that has opened up all kinds of options that you can't do with paper and the kids just think it's so cool when you can work different backgrounds. The variety of things that you um, donate to our cause, but also the fact that they're just such high quality items and I know that they inspire students. This is exactly the kind of donations that are just so hard for us to come by on a regular basis. We're just absolutely so excited. They're just, it's just a free store for them. So they, they're so thankful. They're so appreciative. They actually kind of make a party of it when they come here. They all come together. A lot of the times the principals will let them go early and come and shop. So um, for them, it's just a fun time and they're just so, so appreciative. You know, the, the basic things that Dixon supplies is exactly what our kids need. Crayons, obviously, the Ticonderoga number two pencil is everybody's favorite pencil even um, based on a, a survey that we've done with our teachers wanting to know that, you know, are we selecting the right things. So. I think the important message that I want to deliver to our friends at Dixon Ticonderoga is just what you've meant to us for 15 years. The fact that we can proudly tell everyone in the community that we've distributed more than 6.5 million pencils over the years and you can just bet that nearly every one of those <laughs> has come through the fabulous support um, of Dixon Tech on Road over the years. Well, this has been an exciting journey. We now know what the Dixon Ticonderoga and the Kids in Need teams are really like, and I think we all can agree they are anything but boring. From me, Lisa Mack, Tim Gomez, and the employees here at Dixon Ticonderoga, we wish you a very happy back to school season. We support you!